Hello, future crypto millionaires. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to do some quick technical analysis on Oasis Network, the layer one blockchain designed to enable scalability and confidential compute. Before we begin, make sure that you join my Telegram group. There is a free link in the description below. This is where you can find all the trading setups, news, and ideas that I am looking at every single day. It's a no-brainer, guys. We have been killing it in the group. Also, do me a solid and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click the like button. Let's get straight into it. As you see here on CoinMarketCap, Oasis is currently ranked number 143. The ticker is Rose. The price is at 0 0.075, 3.61% down for the day. And the market cap is currently sitting right below 530 million, 529.71 million to be exact. The market cap is pretty low, and therefore, there is a lot of potential upside here. If we take a look at the all-time chart, we see that, according to CoinMarketCap, Oasis was created back in 2020, so it has experienced another bull run before. In 2022, Oasis pumped all the way up to 56 cents. People took profits, the price action pulled back. And as you see here, we are currently at range lows. This is what we do in this channel, guys. We buy range lows, we sell range highs. This is the chart on trading you. We are looking at rows over USDT, four hour chart on Binance. If we zoom out and we take a look at the daily chart, we see that rows back in 2022 pumped all the way up to 60 cents, according to Binance. People took profits, the price action pulled back and we have been moving inside this accumulation phase for a while. This is the best buying opportunity when it comes to this token, guys. And as you see, we are currently at range lows. The price action is moving inside this green rectangle that I have here on the chart in accumulation zone. Therefore, this is an amazing buying opportunity, at least in my view. As you see here, Rose experienced a very nice pump around February and March of 2024 when the crypto market as a whole experienced a mini bull run. People took profits, the price action pulled back, back inside into this accumulation zone. And then recently, in December, rose pumped all the way up to 13 cents. And again, people took profits, the price action pulled back. And we are currently back inside this accumulation zone once again. Rose managed to pump all the way up to 18 cents during a mini bull run. Therefore, in my opinion, during a full-blown bull run, such as the upcoming altcoin season of 2025, I think Rose is totally capable to surpass that previous local high that we saw of 18 cents and pull a move that's basically a multiple of that move that we saw during this mini bull run. If we zoom into the four hour chart, we can see that the price action has been bouncing on this lower ascending yellow trend line that I have here on the chart. We had a bounce here, another bounce here, another bounce here. Let me circle this so you can see this better. You see, we have a bounce after bounce. So this is a very valid support trend line. If the price action breaks below this, expect more downside. Some of you might want to consider exiting your position. So it might be a very good idea for those of you who scale in above this yellow trend line to set up a stop loss below it, just in case the price action breaks below. So you can exit your position. And then when the price action finds a bottom again, we can talk about another entry. But for now, things look really good. The price action has been bouncing above it. So there is nothing to worry about at the moment. As you see here on the chart, I also have this upper descending yellow trend line that has been acting as a resistance. Look at this. We had a rejection here, another rejection here, another rejection here recently. The price action is pulling back at the moment. What we really want to see is another bounce at this support trend line. If we see something like a double bottom right here or a higher low, that's going to be really bullish. For those of you who want to trade this in a more aggressive manner, you might want to consider accumulate as much rows as possible, as close as you can to this key trend line of support. But be careful because this is not the safest way to trade this. The idea behind this is you are trying to accumulate as much rows as possible, as close as you can to this key support trend line, trying to front run the breakout above the triangle pattern. 
And as I always tell you, trying to front run the breakout is riskier, but also if it plays out, it's more rewarding. It can bring more profits into your pockets. The safest way to trade this is basically to let the price action do its thing as long as it's moving inside this triangle pattern and basically wait for a breakout. So you can buy the breakout, scale in on the readers if it happens, and wait for a continuation move to the upside to hit the rest of the targets. An even safer way to trade this would be to wait until the price action breaks above this key level of resistance that I have here on the chart that's located at 0.085. Buy the breakout, scale in on the readers if it happens, wait for a continuation move to the upside. The price action of Rose has been downtrending the past couple of months. And therefore, if the price action breaks above this key resistance trend line, that's going to be a clear indication that the trend might be changing from a downtrend where we have been putting lower highs and lower lows to an uptrend where we are going to see higher lows and higher highs, something like that, right? That's why buying the breakout is always safer than trying to front run the breakout. Now, for those of you who want to trade this in a more aggressive manner, if you see a pullback all the way down here, that's going to be an amazing buying opportunity. The measured move from all the way down here to this first key level of resistance that's located at 0 0.08503, that's a 25% move, guys. The second target is located all the way up here, around 13 cents at 0 0.1345. The measured move, if we see a pullback all the way down here to this support, to this target, that's a 96% move, almost a 100% move, guys. You can double your money if you catch this move. For those of you who want to trade this in a more safe manner, buying the breakout of this key level of resistance that's located at 0 0.08, for example, the measured move to this target at 13 cents, that's a 58% move. If I zoom out, I have a few more targets here for you. The next target is located at 18 cents, 0 0.1831. If we see a pullback for the aggressive traders, the measured move all the way up here to this target, that's going to be a 167% approximately. If we buy the breakout above this key level of resistance at 0 0.085, the measured move from here to the second target, that's a 114% move. Again, Oasis has a market cap of only 533 million. So as a token, it's not that heavy, guys. It's not as heavy as other large caps that we've been talking about that have a market cap that's well into the billions. If you want to find more info or my price prediction for Rose for 2025, make sure that you watch my other video. Let me know in the comments below, what is your price prediction for Rose for 2025? I really want to know what you guys think. That's all I had for you today. If you want to support the channel, guys, make sure that you subscribe and click the like button. Also, click the bell icon so you receive notifications when I post updates on these setups. Also, make sure that you join my free Telegram group. You can find all these setups with Fibonacci levels of support and resistance in my group. And that's for free. All I'm asking you to do is click the like button, guys, because it helps with the algorithm. And if you have any questions or any tokens that, we, that you want me to talk about in the future, drop them in the comments below and I will make a video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Trade carefully.